I'm running out of things to do at home. <laughs> I had lots to do, but then Mother Nature showed up. Hello, Mother Nature. Been raining all day. I've been waiting for it to stop raining so that I can clean out my gutters. You see how the gutters are, uh, you can't really see it, eh? Anyways, the gutters are uh, spilling over because they're plugged and I need to get up there and clean them out. But I can't get on my roof until it stops raining. I'm not going up there in the rain. Okay, me slip and fall and break my head open? I don't think so. What would Diesel do? Wouldn't be a good idea. So, we've actually been watching Dexter all day. <laughs> Have you guys ever watched Dexter? It's like one of my favorite series, I don't know. Is that kind of weird? It's all about a serial killer, right? But he works with the Miami police down in Florida. And uh, he's sort of like a vigilante. He only takes out the bad guys that the law doesn't catch. You know, the killers that slip through the cracks of the justice system. He goes and takes them out. So he's doing a good service to the community, sort of, if you look at it that way. But at the same time, he's killing them. It's a whole TV series, anyways, very entertaining. And uh, I'm sort of hooked on it, I've been watching it all day. But I need to take a break, because we need to get something done around the house. We can't just be sitting on the couch all day. You wanna see where I've been? <laughs> I got myself all set up over here. Yeah. I haven't been able to just sit and do nothing this whole week that I've been home. It's always been busy, 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 doing something, doing something, doing something. If I have a spare minute, I'm out there making a video or something, trying to do something. And today, I figured, you know what, today it's a rainy day out, kind of depressing. I'm just gonna watch TV. I'm gonna be lazy today. But, even though we're being lazy today, we're still gonna go get the mail. I gotta figure out where I put my fish filters. I bought fish filters and socks at Walmart the other day. And I can't find them. Oh wait, there they are. Oh, what do you know? You just gotta start talking about it and you find it. Remind me if I forget later. They're right there. They look like garbage bags, but really they're bags full of socks and good stuff that I can use. Why are they there? Oh, we'll get the mail and worry about that when we get back. Ah, I've still gotta wrap all my shrubs in these burlap thingers yet before I go on a trip. Ah, so much to do. But it's a rainy day out, so. When it's a rainy day out, you have permission, God-given permission, to be lazy and sit on the couch and watch TV. That's just what you do when it's a rainstorm outside. Right? Right, am I wrong? I probably got it all wrong. Well, that was a big waste of time. Saturday, there's no mail on Saturday. Josh, you know that truck of Josh. Okay, so did I lock this door? Of course I did. I never leave my house without locking every door and window. Alright, so let's take care of this mess here, maybe. Right, that's what we should do today. While watching TV at the same time. Because today's a lazy day. Lazy day. We're all allowed a lazy day. Raced. Take a lazy day. Whoa, I almost fell over. I'd be okay if I fell over though, because it's a lazy day. Then I'd just lay there on the floor for a while. Right now, lazy day. Well, every day is lazy for you, whatever. This is the pizza I got from the, the hotel. Pulled pork pizza. Can you believe it? It's the most delicious thing I've ever tasted in my life. One of the most delicious things. Very, very tasty. So... What should we do? We'll figure something out. Today's vlog may be kind of boring, guys. I'm just gonna warn you in advance. I really want to get back on the road. That's the truth of it. <laughs> I like making videos when I'm traveling. But I know you guys like to watch those videos more than these, too. Uh, a lot of you, anyways, so... Just so you know, I like making those better than these two, but this is just where my life is at. I know one day I'm going to look back at this when I'm older and look back and say, yeah, I remember that day when I hit that moose and I was stuck at home for over a week. You know what I mean? Hey, right, dude. Hey, guys. I'm kind of busy right now being lazy. I'll talk to you later. After much waiting, after much time, 
We have finally organized the music room. We've also decided which room will be the guest bedroom or the extra bedroom, which one will be my music room. So which room will be my music room? Will it be the pink room? Or will it be the blue room? If you guess the blue room, that's right. Got everything cleaned up and set up in here. Mm-hmm, even got a little chair there for some picking. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And those are my drums. Nice little set up. I'm missing a few things. Over the years, I've lost a few parts and I'm gonna have to replace them. Missing a few parts at the top here and the screw. Same with here. And this one's still okay. And these cymbals, I tried cleaning them once. I've had this drum set so long. I tried cleaning it once and I put the wrong chemicals on here and it actually made them worse. So I actually need new cymbals, but, uh, and to dust them off. They're very dusty still. <laughs> Maybe I should have cleaned them before showing them to you. Oh well, that is my, my music world. You bet. That means that this room is next on the hit list. I've got this queen size bed that I can, or the bed frame that I can set up in here, probably along the wall there. And uh, this will be like a extra bedroom for friends come over, they have a place to crash. Sorry guys, if you're gonna crash at my place, <laughs> you're gonna get the pink room. <laughs> uh, oh well. But yeah, so that is uh, what I've been doing today. Yay! And yes, I'll give you a little sample. Give you a little sample of my musical thing. I'm really rusty, so don't judge me. I haven't actually had my drums actually set up to play in years and years. I'm excited to actually play them now and see if I still got it. Headphone warning. Headphone warning. It's gonna be loud. Alright. So, guess I'll show you how rusty I am. I'm sure you guys wanna see that. Don't judge me, I haven't played in a couple of years. What are we gonna play? I'm gonna play something simple, I guess? All right, this is a simple beat. All right, let's start off small. Ready, Diesel? It's gonna be noisy. You ready? He likes noise for some reason. He's sitting right over there off camera. He just loves it. <laughs> You're a weird dog. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. That's my rustiness, that's all you get. I gotta practice a little more and then maybe we'll make some sweet. GoPro, all kinds of different angles, drumming video for you one day. I think I'll have to get proper mics for that, because I don't know how that audio turned out in there at all. Probably all distorted. <laughs> right, Diesel? See, look at this. He's like, he's like right here. Hey, Diesel, you like all the noise? Oh, uh, yeah, I like it, man. I get very excited. I see, I don't know. He's a weird dog. He likes the noise. So, yeah, that's my... That's my little bit there for you. That's all you get. And it's a pretty big thing. I had to put pants on for this clip. Jeez. Dedication to YouTube, man. Tell you what. Tell you what. And I had to put you guys on the tripod. <laughs> Too much information, Trevor Josh. All right. Yeah, we're gonna go back out here. You're on the tripod right now. I guess I can show you. I just picked the whole tripod and walked away like a boss. You know what I'm oh, 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 ooh, it's got the romantic dimmer. How do I make this non-romantic? Oh, it's awkward. All right, okay. All right. See what I mean? I just picked up the whole tripod. <laughs> Maybe the whole thing walked like a boss. Tripod or not. Alright, so, uh, before we do the other room, yeah, we're gonna watch an episode of Dexter. I don't even know how many I've watched today. Come on, am I on? Oh, there's only 12 episodes in the season, man. I almost, I'm on episode 9 there. Helter Skelter. Dexter preoccupied with. It's a good series, uh,. Not for the children, just so you know. Gory scenes and and other things that uh, children 
may not be suitable for. So uh, if you're gonna watch Dexter and check it out, do it after the kids go to sleep, just so you know. Hey, there's a good podcast called When the Kids Go to Sleep. When the kids are fast asleep. Do you know who that is, Diesel? Oh, that's Shay and Colette, man. Yeah, Shay Tards, uh, Shay and Colette, they have a podcast called When the Kids Go to Sleep that I watch all the time. Yeah, that's where I got that from. All right, guys. I don't know. I'm gonna watch some Dexter. So I went to my sister's uh, for a bonfire. Same place we picked up that shed the other day. Just want to point that out. Yeah, that uh, I went there for a bonfire, but we got rained out, so we just hung out inside instead. I got some housewarming gifts from my sister and from my mom. My sister got me a world map with flags that I can hang up on my wall. You guys know how much I like f flags, huh? <laughs> flags and maps. But I have a special strange obsession with maps. I like maps. So she knows this, so she got me a world map. I like maps. Big maps. Big maps, little maps, all maps. I don't know. I like maps. So she got me that, that's pretty cool. And my mom and dad, I'm assuming it's from both of them, unless if dad's getting me a separate housewarming gift. I don't know. <laughs> Probably not, I'm not expecting another gift. But uh, where did I put it? Where? Oh, it's here. My mom got me this. It's for Diesel and me. Well, more for me, but it helps with Diesel. It's a robot sweeper. Sweeps your floors for you every day so you can enjoy life. And uh, let's try reading the French here. <clears throat> you, uh, you French people, you tell me how close I am. Mm -hmm. That first word is hard. Ballet, ballet, vous planchez. No, ballet, vous, vous, no, ballet, vous planchez chaque jour. Pendant que vous profitez de la vie. Let's see if I can say it in one solid sentence. Ballet, vous planchez chaque jour. Pendant que vous profitez de la vie. And I'm not even going to try the Spanish. I'm from Canada. We have English and French up here. No offense, I just, I have no idea how to even start on the Spanish. I won't even try it because I will butcher it worse than I just butchered the French. But, uh, yeah. I thought that was pretty cool. A robo sweeper. Remember I was going to get a robo vac that actually vacuums? But since I have all concrete floors, I don't really need a vac. I just need to be swept up, right? Get all this hair out of here. So now I got this little gizmo that does it for me. Check it out, check it out. So that's it, we're gonna see what Diesel thinks of it. It has a pretty low battery. It's supposed to charge for 12 hours and it's only really been charging for one. So I don't know how long it's gonna go. Let's see what Diesel's does. Diesel, and what, do you know what this thing is? This thing's gonna keep our floors clean, man. What is that thing, man? What is it? Oh, it's coming back for you, man. It's coming back for you. Pretty much what it does is it bumps into things and it just redirects itself, right? So eventually, you leave this thing going for about two hours, right? And eventually it should get over your entire floor. Oh, there it goes. Oh, lift up the cord. It gets right along the edge and stuff and it'll hit that dunk. And it'll turn around. What's that diesel? What is that? What is it, man? Oh, he's coming! To, he's coming to get me! He's coming to get me! Save my diesel! <laughs> Cheap girls. See, it literally, it's like a ping pong ball. It just bounces around your house and it sweeps your floors for you. You let it go for long enough. They say within like two hours, it should get the entire surface of your house, depending on how big your house is. But this works perfect for me because it's all one level, right? And there's no bumps and it's all just concrete. So this will sweep, sweep my floors for me. But the batteries are kind of low yet. Whoops, oh, oh, oh. Lift the cord, lift the cord. Mm -hmm. So I'm assuming it goes faster. <laughs> so we'll charge it overnight and we'll see how it works tomorrow morning. Get him, Jesus, get him. Get him, get him. Get him, man. Oh, what's he gonna do now? Uh-oh. It doesn't like that chair very much. I think it got stuck. Oh, there we go. 
I'll have to watch that. I'll get stuck on those chairs. Just because it sort of ramps up and the wheels weren't touching the ground. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'll stop it here. So really all it is, is just two wheels under here. Eh? And it just redirects itself whenever it jams and stuff. So yeah, this should keep my floors reasonably cleaner, hopefully. That's a pretty cool gift. That's something I can really use. I'm just gonna let that go. The batteries are just about dead, like I said. So anyways, that was my my show and tell for the day. I love it. <laughs> I know I'm gonna be occupied by this for like two hours. I'm just gonna, the whole two hours, I'm just gonna be following it around everywhere. Oh no, there's a bone. Look out, there's a bone. Oh, he's going in the bathroom. Oh, wait, no, oh, oh. Yeah, there you go, he's going in the bathroom, man. Clean that bathroom floor, man. Clean that bathroom floor. <laughs> That's hilarious. Diesel, get out of the way, man. He's coming for you. See, it gets every little corner eventually. <laughs> that is entertaining. That will entertain me for a long time. Who needs TV? I got a robo sweeper. Anyways, guys, I'm going to, uh... Oh, it's 11 o'clock. I'm gonna start getting ready for bed, but I'll talk to you in a bit. Lordy, lordy, lordy. It's 12.30. I just spent an hour and a half editing yesterday's video. The video you saw yesterday. Almost two hours, actually. Wait, 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 no, it was 11. No. I don't know, I spent more than time than I thought. I mean, I get sucked into my, my editing here. This is my editing, my station. And I won't even notice it, because, I mean, I enjoy doing it. So I start the vlog. It's more of a chore to get it started, right? I gotta tell myself, okay, I gotta get this done. I gotta set some time aside. I gotta get this done. And as soon as I start and I play that first clip, it sucks me in, right? And then I just, I, I can't stop i can't do anything i cannot interrupt my editing time until it is done i will not get up until i am done that video i don't know why it just it, i love doing it it just sucks me in once you start you just can't stop it is an addicting process making youtube videos i don't know I just like doing it because I can look back on my day and laugh about what I did yesterday. I keep saying this in all my vlogs. I know that there will be a day way in the future when I'm elderly vlogging still, trying to cross the street while I'm vlogging with my cane. And it'll be the whole vlog, just me getting across the street. <laughs> you know that I'm going to be doing that. And I'm still going to be looking back on these vlogs back when I was 26 thinking, that was a strange feller back then. That was a strange time in my life. I'll be looking back at it. Maybe I'll be proud of who I was. Some days I'll probably just be shaking my head at myself, thinking, I was one strange cookie. Tell you what. But I really don't want to look back on my life and see that I wasted it. I want to make every day count. So that's what my vlogs are all about. They're about sharing with you guys, but also sharing with my future self. You know what I mean? I wanna be able to look back on every day of my life as I grow older, have like a video journal. I've mentioned this before, a vlernal. Vlernal. Anyways guys, thanks for watching today. I didn't do much today, it was a lazy day. Remember that? I warned you. What were you expecting? Fireworks? You don't shoot fireworks off on a lazy day. I guess you could. I should have bought fireworks. Shoot. Could have fireworks. Maybe we'll get fireworks yet before we leave. Not promising anything, because fireworks are expensive in Canada. I've noticed in the United States, fireworks are so cheap. Well, everything's so cheap down there. It's like really cheap. You guys are... But, uh... Up here, everything's more expensive, and fireworks up here are really expensive. And they're not as good as the fireworks in the States. They have more regulations on them up here. Because they go bang, and it scares the moose. Remember what we said about moose? I'm just joking. I'm just being weird. I'm tired. I don't know what to say to you guys anymore. So I'm just rambling. I'm going to stop this now and encourage you to smash that like button. I know I didn't do much today, but smash the like button for lazy days. You know you all have lazy days or you want a lazy day. If you like lazy days, 
smash the like button. Because every now and then everyone deserves one of these. Even though I did set up my drum room, so it wasn't a total lazy day. And I went for a bonfire at my sister's house, so I did get out of the house. So technically, I still have a lazy day to account for. <laughs> Making excuses. See you tomorrow, 4 a.m. Central Time, right here for whatever I'm doing tomorrow.